Peyton Nelson. And I'm Dawson Otto. Welcome back to HTTV. We tell you what's up. So let's jump into the final week of February. Okay, so on the 25th, it was the first round of basketball regions for the boys, and they lost against Westington Springs. The first level track practice was then, but we're not starting yet, and it was Barrett Hofer's birthday. Uh, 26, boys basketball regions continue. Um, and then today was the science fair here in Tulare. Uh, 28th, girls basketball, uh, Sweet 16, and the winners of those games go on the state. And it's Gentry Puffer's birthday today, and that is the final, or tomorrow, is Gentry Puffer's birthday. And that's it. That's uh, all we have for this month of February. So let's jump over to our elementary interview with Dawson. Hi, my name is Dawson Otto, and I'm here with Crew Looter. Hi, Crew. Hey. What grade are you in? Second. Um, what's your favorite subject in school? Art. Uh, what are you learning today in school? Um, phonics, science, things like that. Sounds fun. What do you do out at recess? Um, play basketball. Even better. I like the sound of that. Um, so it's Read Across America Week or something. What's your favorite book? Um... Fly Guy? No, not Fly Guy. What is it called? Um, f fly Guy. Okay. I'll have to read that sometime. Now to Trajan. Thanks, Dawson, for that interview. Now let's throw it over to Kobe as it interviews the senior basketball players. Hello, this is Kobe with the HTTV Sports News. On February 25th, the boys played Westington Springs and Westington Springs for the first round of Regions and they lost 25-42 to 42, and Ty Hofer was the leading scorer with 7 points and 8 rebounds. Now I have a chance to sit down with the senior basketball players. I'm Kobe Stoner here and I'm with Dawson Otto, the only senior basketball girl. I got a couple questions for her. What was your favorite part about basketball? Uh, my favorite part about basketball was probably getting to play the games with the girls and having another year with Coach Smith. Um, it was way more enjoyable with her there. Um, and getting to the championship in 281, although we didn't win, it was still really fun. What will you miss the most about basketball? Um, probably just playing um, out on the court. I've played it for so many years, so it's that's probably what I'll miss. What was your favorite game to play in? My favorite game to play in was probably the 281 championship again because it is the championship game and it, the environment's really fun to play in. What was your favorite memory about basketball? My <laughs> My favorite memory about basketball was winning 281 last year because um, it was our first time in like probably 15 years or so. So that was really exciting to finally be able to do that. All right, thank you. Back to you. Hello, I'm Kobe here, and I'm with the senior boys basketball team, and I got a few questions for them. What was your favorite part about basketball? Um, favorite part about basketball was probably the group of guys you're with. Just a lot of fun and a lot of inside jokes and different things that go on in the locker rooms and during the game. My favorite part about basketball would probably be just playing the sport and hanging out with the guys and stuff and yeah. My favorite part about basketball is just getting being able to play the sport. It's a very fun sport. What will you miss the most? Um, definitely just the team camaraderie and then just playing basketball. I mean, getting to be involved with Coach Smith and Coach Flaherty and uh, uh, Coach Knoll. It's a lot of fun to be with them and getting involved and making inside jokes and just having fun. The thing I'll miss the most about basketball is just um, playing with the team and uh, 
practices. Practices were definitely fun and ha messing around with the coaches and other basketball players. So, the thing I'm gonna miss the most is probably everyone in general. What was your favorite game to play in? Um, favorite game to play in was probably last year uh, when we played Redfield Doland. The crowd was just really into it, and it was a crazy atmosphere to play in and lots of fun. My favorite game was also to play in Redfield because we almost pulled the upset, and the crowd was really into it. And another f game that I really enjoyed was playing against Wolsey as it was pretty much the same crowd, so it was a lot of fun. My favorite game to play in was this year playing against Potter County because everyone thought I had the best game of my career, and I think I also had it too. What was your favorite memory? Um, favorite memory, probably just like even just a practice um, with a few guys in our locker room. You kind of pull pranks on each other once in a while, and uh, it might have gone a little too far this time, but yeah, that's what. My favorite memory was uh, beating Wolsey last year. Favorite memory would probably have to be just hanging out with everyone in the locker room and out on the court and you know, all the practices. Thank you, guys. Back to you. Thanks, Kobe. Now we're going to jump into our senior spotlight with Peyton. Hi, this is Peyton Nelson. We're here with the first senior spotlight with Cody Anderson. So, Cody, what are you doing after high school? Uh, I'm going to Lake Erie Tech. Uh, what's your uh, major going to be? Uh, precision A. Why are you going into this career? Well, I'm going into this career because I am interested in technology and farm equipment and learning how it works. What's been your favorite high school memory? Oh, my favorite high school memory would be probably hanging out with all the kids, going out and having fun. Thanks, Cody. Mm -hmm. That wraps up this week's edition of HGTV. Remember to be awesome. Not average. average.